जय श्री माता जी एवरी वन वेलकम टू द मॉर्निंग मेडिटेशन सेशन लेट एस ऑल टूगेदर हम्बली ऑफर आर हार्ट टू द लोटस फीट ऑफ आर मदर रेज आर कुंडलिनीस एंड टेक अ बंधन We humbly seek permission from the Divine Mother to allow us to meditate on her lotus feet. Mother, we completely surrender to you. Please give us that state that we connect with the Parampita Paramatma. Let us keep both our hands on Mother Earth and seek forgiveness because we touch her with our feet. Hey Adi Bhumi Devi, please forgive us. Please forgive the whole mankind. Slowly, let us move our attention to the Mooladhar. We request Sri Ganesha. to please manifest through us. O Sri Ganesha, please manifest your soothing qualities through us. Give us your wisdom. 
Give us your purity. Give us the chastity. Please give us the power of discrimination. Think our right hand on Mother Earth and left hand on the lap. Let us say Shri Nirmal Ganesha Mantra. Om Tvameva Sakshat Shri Nirmal Ganesha Sakshat Shri Adi Shakti Mataji Shri Nirmala Devye Namo Namaha Shri Mataji, I am innocent. Attention on center muladhar, both hands on lap. Let us say Sri Ganesha Gauri Mantra. Om Pramiva Sakshat Sri Ganesha Gauri Sakshat Sri Adi Shakti Mataji Shri Nirmala Devye Namo Namaha Mother, please make me innocent. Keeping the left hand on Mother Earth. Attention on right Muladhar. Shri Kartikeya Sakshat. Om Tvameva Sakshat. Shri Kartikeya Sakshat. Shri Adi Shakti Mataji. Shri Nirmala Devye Namo Namaha Shri Mataji, please make me worthy of your appreciation and love.
सर्व राक्षसा हंत्री साक्षात ओम थमे व साक्षात सर्व राक्षस हंत्र साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माताजी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नम ओ मदर यू आर द डिस्ट्रॉयर ऑफ ऑल द इविल एंड यू आर द किलर of all the devils and demons shri mata ji please destroy all the negativities let us move our attention to the heart today and keep our right hand on the left heart we will say shivoham shivoham 12 times and in our heart silently we will repeat i am the spirit that is the meaning of shivoham 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 
श्री माता जी बाय योर ग्रेस आई एम द प्योर स्पिरिट श्री माता जी प्लीज फिगिव मी for any mistakes that i have done against my spirit mother please make me your divine instrument attention on the right heart keeping our left heart left hand on the right heart we will say the name of shri sita ram 12 times and in our heart we will request mother to be the responsibility in me shri sita ram represents the responsibilities साक्षात श्री सीताराम साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नम ओम तमे साक्षात श्री सीताराम साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नम ओम तमे साक्षात श्री सीताराम साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नम ओम तमे साक्षात श्री सीताराम साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नम साक्षात श्री सीताराम साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नम ओम तमे साक्षात श्री सीताराम साक्षात 
श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नमः ओम नम साक्षात श्री सीताराम साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नमः ओम नम साक्षात श्री सीताराम साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नमः ओम नम साक्षात श्री सीताराम साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नमः ओम नम साक्षात श्री सीताराम साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नमः ओम नम साक्षात श्री सीताराम साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नमः ओम नम साक्षात श्री सीताराम साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नमः माता यू आर द रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी विद इन मी एंड यू are the boundaries of good conduct mother please guide me in all my actions slowly we move our attention to the center heart and we can keep our right hand on the center heart this is the place of shri jagadamba the adi shakti herself we will Say Ma Jagadamba twelve times, feeling her love inside our heart, and requesting her to make us fearless. Ma Jagadamba, Ma Jagadamba. Ma Jagadamba, Ma Jagadamba, Ma Jagadamba, Ma. Jagadamba, Ma Jagadamba, Ma Jagadamba, Ma Jagadamba. Ma 
Keeping our attention in the heart and requesting Mother, Oh Mother, please come in my heart. Please make my heart big so that you and your love can reside in my heart. May I spread your love across all the oceans. Maintaining this state, we will listen to Srimataji's talk where she's guiding us how we can open our heart. Freeze the heart. So these two conditionings, which actually are on the brain, these two conditions freeze the heart and also make the domain of heart as zero and then the brain starts asserting itself. That is how we do not know how to be kind to others, how to be nice, how to be helpful, how to be gentle and how to be reassuring, protecting others. All this we have inherited already. We have already got a stone heart when we come to Sahaja Yoga and we have a brain either full of ego or super ego. So now with your Kundalini rising, you can clear out your head first of all. So the sincerity will come when the Kundalini will move and touch your Brahmarandra which is the seat of your heart and will expand, then the heart just comes back like a king, returns back and starts dominating the brain. When the heart comes back, immediately find those people with whom we are angry, we would not talk, we had nothing to do, suddenly you become friendly with them. There's no problem. In many ways, people have harmed you. All that harming and everything just disappears. And you start becoming so nice and beautiful. What has happened that Kundalini has touched your Brahmarandra? Where is the seat of heart? And as soon as that opens out, your heart also opens. And it gets awakened, it thinks, oh, what? 
I have allowed this brain to rule me, how dare it rules me? It just jumps on it. And we have seen people, suddenly there is so much transform that is remarkable. The one gentleman in America, he said that, Mother, after realization I was so much changed that I become a very mild person. And I never used to wish my uncle or anyone. So he met him in some sort of a fate and then he said, Hello, uncle. The uncle started looking at him. Are you all right? He would never say that. Then he went and saw, Are you all right, uncle? Are you keeping all right? Can I do something for you? Very nice thing, he said. Uncle said, What have you been doing? Are you drunk or what? How can you speak so sweetly to me? I can't believe it. That's what happens. And that's why we have to understand that all these things can be easily dropped out because we have acquired them. They can be finished off because we have acquired them. They need not be all our lives, our uh, relations. So, ego and superego. Both can be blasted off once your heart is awakened. So, when we are dealing with people, we have to break the ice also by communicating with others in a very decent manner, like telling yourself, no, I don't believe that this man is so bad, let me look after him, he may be all right. He said, I don't think he's so bad. So, to accept somebody is bad is very easy for human beings and once they start accepting such a thing, then they build up a kind of a fortress in which they live and they think they are the best people and nobody else are good. And thus the whole community, the whole society, the whole humanity gets bitten by these ideas. And Sahaja Yoga is the only way which is going to cure it. Sahaja Yoga is the only way which is going to finish this. And that part is to be prayed by you people to understand that sincerity can only come if you raise your Kundalini again and again and open your Brahmarat. Then your heart will rise. It will become a very awakened personality and it will take charge of your brain, which is all the time thinking, thinking, thinking like mad. And once that happens, then you will realize that now you have jumped into doubtless awareness. So the relationship between the two has to be fully understood. At first the domination of the heart, or the, we can say the kinghood of heart is challenged, is put down, not to zero, and then this brain becomes the king and he starts ruling us. I think, I feel, means the brain, the ego. If you could give up, I think, I want, everything will be all right. You should say, I want is not the point, this body wants it. You separate yourself. Gradually you start separating yourself from all such situations by never saying, I want. You should say, this body, this hand, this head. You start separating. And once you are separated, all these barriers of ego and superego will disappear. But as it is, also it's very easy to get rid of these two, it's very easy to get rid of these two, only by raising your Kundalini and breaking your Brahmarata. This is the greatest achievement that you have got, that you can break your Brahmarata, make your Kundalini uh, get connected with all pervading power. That's why I always say you must meditate and you must be in thoughtless awareness that it works out. Like uh, from the river Ganges, if you have to fetch the water, you must have proper pitchers, which are deep enough to receive the water. 
But if you take a stone, what can you bring out of it? But the Ganges flows, it is what it is. It has its all capacities in it. It doesn't change because you people have taken stones. So now you have to understand that raise your Kundalini as many times as you can. Try to put attention to your Kundalini all the time. See where is the problem is, get it cleared out, absolutely cleared out. Find out where the problem is and raise your Kundalini many a times and see that you are flowing all right on your, on your fontanel bone area so that your heart expands. It's a mechanical process in a way, you can say that. But even that you people don't do. If you had done that, your heart would have increased. And you yourself will say, Mother, my heart has become large like Isha. And then you see the miracle of the heart, how it emits vibrations by which you become such compassionate, such dynamic, beautiful people and so sincere to Sahaja. I would request you to open your heart today for this puja. You have been very jubilant and happy and must be your heart must have opened. Because I've seen Sahaja Yogis have a very large heart for me, but for themselves they don't have. They'll do everything for me, but nothing for themselves. They'll work morning till evening to decorate the hall, to do everything. They must have sent all these flowers to me from everywhere. But if I tell them, you meditate for yourself, that they will not do. Or you achieve this for yourself, that they will not do. This is the situation. So instead of wasting all your energy for decorating all these things, you should decorate yourself within yourself. With sincerity, with nice thoughts about yourself, that you are capable, absolutely capable people. And you can use your imagination, your intelligence, rationality, whatever you think you have, to find the way, to find the way, again I say, to keep your heart large. And this is the message for today's birthday all over the world. Because Thank you for showing me who I am. I am the instrument of your pure love. Mother, I am your divine power. Shri Mataji, Please establish my Self-Realization. Open my Sushumana Nadi and keep me in balance. 
Let us raise our Kundalini a few times, requesting her very gently using our right hand, taking a few strands up to the Brahmarandra. Oh Mother Kundalini, please enlighten all my chakras. Let us listen to this bhajan.
Mataji for this beautiful knowledge and requesting her to establish our self-realization. After that, we will raise our kundalini and take a bandhan. Thank you everyone for joining today. May you have a normal day.